All right, we're finally ready for Hello World. We just saw Model View Controller. We're not going to use the model at all, and we're going to fake a view in the controller itself. We'll see our first example of the full MVC architecture in the next chapter. This here is the main and currently only controller, the application controller. And now we're going to define a Ruby function called hello, which I can make using def tab. It's called a tab trigger, supported by lots of different text editors. Def hello, that defines hello. And now in the context of MVC, this is what's called an action. Actions live inside of controllers. So this is the hello action. And now I'm going to render just a little bit of text as HTML. Just the simple string, hello world. Conventionally all lowercase for historical reasons. You can save that. Let's take a look at our application. So this is still the default. Yay, you're on Rails. There's just one thing left to do, which is to configure our application to route the main URL, that home page that we just visited, to this action. And the way to do that is in config slash routes. You can see there's a comment here indicating that there's a Rails guide on routing get rid of that for now. Now the syntax for this is to define the so-called root route. This is the root of our application. In Rails, this is just the word root. And then we say the name of the controller, in this case, application, because it's the application controller right here. And then this hash symbol and the name of the action, which is just hello. Save that, refresh this, and there we go. Hello world. So at this point, we've successfully made a working web application to display the string, hello world. It may not seem like much, but this is a huge step forward.